On Tuesday, July 23rd, Pikeville High School hosted their first summer bookmobile to promote reading during summer break. The bus, along with some PHS staff, made several stops in the Pikeville area to give a book to every child they could. Mountaintop News caught up with the bus at Model City Daycare to take a look. It's been great for us. We, we've we've gotten to come out and see our kids, and, and it's uh, it's a nice break in the summer. You know, it's it's really it's really kind of quiet in the summer uh, when we don't have any kids in our school, and, and this is what we signed up to do. We we love kids, and, and we love getting to spend time with with uh, our kids. And so, you know, when our when our DLCs came to us and said, "Hey, we want to do a bookmobile," we we kind of started brainstorming and had a meeting, and uh, and so we, we were able to work it out and. You know, it takes a, a great group of our staff members who kind of, they just volunteered to come out here today and, and, and to go, come out and visit with our kids. And, you know, a, a ton of credit goes to our folks who, who came up with this idea and then they ran with it. And we appreciate Mike and, and all the folks at Transportation for being willing to, to take a bus and decorate it into a bookmobile. And uh, it takes a lot of people to be involved and everybody's been willing to do that without complaining because they're really excited to get to see our kids and uh, to be out in our community today. Appalachian Wireless loves the holidays, so it's Christmas in July. Check out this Christmas in July deal. One penny for an iPhone 13 on a two-year contract with a mix and match or Appalachian Unlimited plan. Merry Christmas in July. We are you. We are Appalachian Wireless. Trimble adds that the Pikeville community is one that values education and says the bookmobile was a great success. Those involved in the program have made a big effort to see it happen. This community is one that loves education and has always supported kids. And uh, any, anything we do, we're, we're, we're blessed to get to see that and they continually demonstrate how much they love our kids in this community and it's what makes this place so special and so we appreciate that and, and, and like I say, a July where you get to see and I think we're probably nearing 100 kids by the time we leave here and we've still got five stops left, four stops so you know that's a lot of kids and uh, you know like I say, it's a business we're in and we love it and we're glad that we're able to get a little break and actually get out and see our kids today. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.